Make sure to check out my video installation for these bar and mirrors. I'll include the link in the description and comment section of this video. I installed these bar and mirrors with bar and weights that have a recess there that allows me to install the bar and mirrors on the bar and weight. This is the easiest and best way to install these mirrors because it will reduce or eliminate any vibration. Yeah, we're gonna put these cheap bar and mirrors to the test. Let's see if they'll hold up. See how they perform. Let's go for a ride. You are watching Cycle Cruises all on one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today. Continue to leave video suggestions, but you may find what you're looking for by visiting my website at cyclecruiser.com and click on the menu tab, My Videos. And those are a bunch of playlists with all of my videos categorized in them to make it easier for you to navigate through. Here's what the stock mirrors look like. They work pretty good. They just stand out like antennas. Ah, uh, that looks way better, guys. Much better. I'm telling you, man. By the way, if you haven't seen my installation video on these bar and mirrors, uh, I'll include a link to the video and also to these bar and mirrors in the description and comment section of this video. Ultra cheap, guys. Less than $20. As opposed to CRG bar and mirrors that cost $100 a piece almost. Or $50 a piece or whatever. They Bar and mirrors can range up to $300 for a pair. Which I think is absolutely ridiculous. And I refuse to pay those prices for stupid bar and mirrors man. These are actually my first set of bar and mirrors. Except for my uh, WR250R and YZ450FX. Which those are uh, hand guard mirrors. But it's pretty much the same thing. But I will tell you guys, on a sport bike, I absolutely love bar and mirrors. I like them better than the stock mirrors, man. And I don't understand why you guys get those little tiny spy Rizoma ones that, oh, they look, you say they look so cool and you can hardly see them. Yeah, you can't see nothing but your elbows with those suckers <laughs> and they don't fold. You know what I'm saying? And they're like $150 a piece. Like, how in the hell are you going to spend that much money for some bar and mirrors, man? You guys waste money. That's why a lot of you guys are broke and have to finance your bikes. Because you're buying, you're buying paying all that money for stupid stuff, man. When you can get a set of these Chinese bar and mirrors, knockoffs, that are excellent. Look at that. Pop! For those of you lane splitters, look at that. You can adjust them real nice. Oh man, I'll tell you guys. Well, let's get out here on the road and test them out. Put them to the test, speed test. First off, they are super clear, guys. Super clear. Oh man. Oh! God, this bike is a beast. <laughs> man, this bike is a beast. Woo! Oh my goodness! Oh man! Woo I love these super corset tires too. I wouldn't want them in wet weather though, I'll tell you that. I will tell you guys, there is absolutely zero vibration with these mirrors. None. Zero. Nada. Just pure clearness. Damn this thing is a beast man my goodness this thing pulls <laughs> man and these mirrors are 100% legit baby look at that clearness clearness and all I'm seeing is behind me in road I don't see none of my elbows my forearms hands none of that like some of the other uh, bar and mirrors I like them bigger like this because you can really see behind you that's what they're there for why put bar and mirrors on your bike if they're no good just for looks that's stupid just don't put any mirrors on <laughs> or just put a little one here on the left side for legal purposes but oh my goodness boy Woo! this bike <laughs> in stock form mind you guys in stock form this bike is an absolute beast look, look at that no vibration, guys. Woo! 
<laughs> oh man! Woo! <laughs> yeah, baby. Zero vibration in them bar and mirrors, baby. Zero. Nada. Just clearness all behind me, baby. Clearness. I love it. And like I said, for those of you in California, boop, boop. And you don't have to worry about these folds on you at speed, as you can see. As you saw, should I say. Uh, these mirrors are legit so far, guys. As you guys know, I passed the drop test in my installation video. I Guys, I dropped this, not even a scratch on there, man. These are pretty good, man. I dropped one by accident, it didn't even get a scratch. The mirror didn't come out, nothing. And a lot of you guys, you know, like to group all the Chinese stuff together, all the mirrors, but they're not all made in the same manufacturer. They're not all the same, guys. Some are better than others. Believe me, I'm the king of Chinese stuff, man. And I keep flipping the throttle because it's natural. Oh my God! Oh my God! <laughs> this bike is such a beast! Oh man! It just pulls like no tomorrow. Like a freight train, man. Gosh, I thought the X Diablo pulled hard, guys. X Diablo ain't got nothing on this, man. <laughs> Woo! Oh my goodness! But I look at him, baby. Look at them mirrors. Looking good, proper. Look at that. <laughs> Woo! She look pretty, boy. Thumbs up to these cheap Chinese. Folding bar in mirrors. Absolutely awesome. So, like I said, link to get these in the description and comment section of this video. And also, for those of you guys who want to get my gear, you know, like the camo pants on rocket, my leather jackets, boots, helmets, gloves, leather jackets, cameras, all my stuff. I always include links in the description and comment section of my videos. Or go to my website, psychocruiser.com and click on the menu tab my gear thumbs up check out my playlist for new riders and popular videos don't forget to comment and subscribe and check out my other channel book out moto where i customize a van for my motorcycle so i can live in my van with my motorcycle and travel across the country anywhere subscribe to my youtube channel book out moto